Hello teacher, my name is Gabriel Espinosa. Hello everyone, once again, right here. So we are in the photo number one for the text number one, and we have to uh, see a video that tell us what about the gastronomy and culinary arts. We got three questions that we have to answer in base to the video. So let's start right now. The question number one is, what relationship does exist between gastronomy and culinary art? So we have to understand that the Dominican culture is really big and we got origin in other countries. And then we have to understand that the gastronomy is the worst in the word in general that we got. So when you are like studied, culinary art is for be a uh, discovered to other flavors and other type of food, how to make it. If it, you need to know that you got many ways to do something and you got the um, ability for discover one exactly flavor about that food that you study for. So this is uh, this is kind of uh, difficult to explain because the gastronomy is in our culture mm -hmm. all the gastronomy is big because all the countries have a, gas a specifically gastronomy so in this case when you are studying the culinary art you need to like involve in in other type of food, other type of way to do the food, other type of way of for um, doing something. I'm explaining that. When you are like study that type of career, you are in the way that mm. you need to learn and discover other lines other types, other ways to, to taste the food. That's a little different gastronomy and culinary art. The gastronomy has in all of our culture, the culinary art is the way that you study the gastronomy and you study to discover other flavors, other tasted and all of that. The second question is, why it is important to study this kind of career? Of course, it's important because if you uh, study for being a chef, you need to uh, focus that you want to be one of the best chef. Just because of yes, it's not like that. Because when you study a career, you want to you wanna be in the top. You want to be uh the the face for the for your mark for your way if you got a restaurant or something um you want the people um get involved with you get involved in your food get involved in your tasting in your way that you on that you learn and put in your ability to get um many ways uh, to do the food in your own mark. That's the importance of that. The second question is, what are the advantages to, of to the culinary art of art for tourism in the Dominican Republic? Of course. Uh, our origin is in other country, but our food our way to make it is just because of us. When a person is like learning about Dominican food, it's really simple to understand what kind of origin that we have. Europeans, uh, the Asians, in the other part of the world. But in this case, the tourism is very important in our, in our culture because 
that's the one of the best way to get uh, a better job, a better um, way to be involved in the tourism place. And then if you are in a restaurant or in a hotel that has a restaurant and you involve that, you want to, that I said before, be on the top. And then it's because you started because you are a person who started that type of career because you need to show to the others that you study for that and because you do something better for you. And that is one of the most important thing. Culinary art is not a play game. It's really an important career because you, if you are a chef, you need to understand that you're gonna be a good chef. The gastronomy is really simple in our country, but it's because of the places, uh, of the cities that we have. Because if you go into the South, you wanna see many different kind of things to make one thing and the other. And then, um, the tourism way is one of the best kind of job that somebody can have in our country. And it's important to know about the top of the food, the quality, the, the hospitality that you can uh, offer to our clients. And I think I'm finished. Three questions. <laughs> Have a great night, teacher.